Oh, don't mind me, an extraction shooter enjoyer. I'm just eating right now. Oh, what am I eating? Well, here, have a look. Just a little bit of Hunt Showdown, some Tarkov, Marauders, and a little bit of Call of Duty DMZ. Mm, it's, it's so good. Mm, so tasty. Mm, mm. It really is a good time to be an extraction shooter enjoyer. There are plenty of titles to pick and choose from, and more on the horizon. Call of Duty DMZ is just around the corner, and shaping up to be a Tarkov competitor. Tarkov is still Tarkov. If you like its unique and unforgiving gameplay, you can hop in right now. Hunt Showdown boasts a unique environment and PvP that you won't find many other games exploring. And Marauders brings Tarkov-style gameplay, but you're a space pirate. And that alone is really freaking cool. All these games bring something to the scene that I really enjoy. Competition. More games competing in the same market means each game has to keep up or fall behind. And I'm interested in seeing how each of these titles handles this newfound competition. And hopefully for us, it means more content from each title. But what the future holds is unknown. At the very least, it's a very exciting time to be enjoying this genre of games. But that was my little ramble, and now, here are some clips from Hunt Showdown. You are you gonna, or Will, are you gonna get Overwatch 2? No. No. Do you see, uh, you know what the new headline I saw from it was? Oh, doggy fucking doggy serpent serpent I'm, going fuck doggy. I'm going to kill him, 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 I'm going to kill him. Did he just sneaky handed? Tony, give me you my fucking belly back! Son of a bitch! <laughs> Tony, you fuck, give me my fucking belly back! I found Tony. Oh, he's got an Avto? <laughs> yeah, he's got an Avto. <laughs> I wasn't ready. No, me either. <laughs> Our battle cry. <laughs> this is the stupidest. <laughs> oh shoot, I'm up. Yeah, you're up. They got their. They didn't get their boy up. They're trying, they're trying. Tagged her. They throw a hellfire. They got him up, they got him up. Bomb went on me, bomb went on me, please shoot him, please shoot him, please! I just came back, sorry. I nice shot. <laughs> There's another team. Over there, they're all over there. Okay, I, I need to heal. Let's fall back, fall back, go down here, go down here. Yep. No! Fine. Go all the way around. They're flanking you guys. Yeah. They're climbing the ladder, climbing the ladder, getting up top here. Oh my fuck, okay. I'm falling back. One's inside. One hundred percent, one's inside back here. Where's he at? Dead. Nice. Through the wall. Killed her. Killed the other. Uh, the dude's in the second building back here. Oh, I spin the barrel because it's so funny.
people inside by me as well. Oh, I'm clipping, I'm clipping. One more story trying to replicate, because Yours. when I started doing that, I was trying to do, like, Javier Bardem, is what I was trying to do. What you are about to witness is a glimpse into what me and my friends Peanut Brains find funny. Essentially, it's doing impressions of voices while saying outlandish things. That's it. For whatever reason, this is the secret formula for making ourselves laugh to the point of actual pain. Does it ever make sense? Almost never. But oh boy, do we get a hell of a kick out of it. No, I'm just copying you. What makes a cool? What a good time. He plays the box. Jock Sparrow. Hear the man from behind of his cock. He blacked. Get it off. Do Gandalf. What's the guy who's got the black, Gandalf. who owns the black pearl? No, do Gandalf. Gandalf with his hand on his cock. I am the man. <laughs> 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 I have my hand! I have my hand! I have my hand on his car! I have become Gandalf the White from Lumius Tullius! Or I need my hand on my car! I am the man! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're not done. We're done with this. It needs to stop. It's never You have the picture and like holding up the staff and in, in yeah, the yeah, fucking yeah, like yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah. have been stroking and an immense pain and calloused skin <laughs> <laughs> for ten thousand <laughs> lifetimes. <laughs> this is such a stupid fucking bit. God, I hate it. Return to me, Smeagol's Cagrin! Return to me, Smeagol's Cagrin! We need it to come! We need detention! Please do on it! In my sleep, they took it off me! My precious, my precious goop mask! Me took it! Me took it! I was busy, nasty, thieving horses! What if, what if, what if fucking Smeagol followed around? What if Smeagol just followed them around in like full BDSM gears, just like leathered up and like following them around? You just hear chains clinking around. <laughs> you just hear a whip just. Game! Game! <laughs> Anytime he's explaining anything, he's just pinching his nipples aggressively. <laughs> yeah, yeah, or like stimulating. He's, he's just... <laughs> oh. What is... <laughs> Can the people believe I do this shit sober? You imagine. That poor FBI guy, dude. <laughs> he's probably having a blast. He's probably like, this is the yeah, easiest probably. job I fucking work. I fucking love coming into work on Sunday. <laughs> Can I check an 8 out this window? No, do it. It's gone that way. One's up top here. Got one. It wrecked. Close, close, close. He's in. Not dead, not dead. Close. I hit him one? Okay, nice. One more. Should be. I'll scan. Yeah, one more down here. Probably rising. He's like right on your left.